The minute it's been a hot minute, been a really hot minute. I'll tell you what's been a hot minute down here, dude. Um, with wide cam, obviously showing off everything. So investing. I have been in my head a bit lately, but we're back. So I now invest weekly. I have recurring investments in what you may ask. Well, you look right here. If you can read it. $2. And two dollars into sheep, two dollars into Doge. Happens every other week, I think, for both, or something like that. I don't quite remember. But in case it goes up again, it booms. I'm gonna go stupid. I'm gonna sell off. You know, I'm buying dips right now. I'm just letting it just go down and down and down. So I'm really just chilling right now with the crypto. Like, I, I, it can't hurt, right? It can't hurt, like. It went up, it went down, it'll probably go back up. If it doesn't, well, I'll just hop out with the money I had. And if it keeps going down, then, you know, fuck me. I got unlucky. $2 or a couple cents worth of crypto. Whatever. I'm fine. But we're not here for that. You're not here for that. We're here for the acorns. Now, um, today is a... So as you can see here, we stay at 860 for that. Uh, we have some recurring investments. Um, the stock is very low. Just yesterday, I was up at 9%, maybe, and we've gone down a lot. My new, my new recurring investment is... Remember, I'm not a statistical guy. Don't take my word. I'm not a financial advisor. I'm not anything legal or proper. I'm just a dude sharing what I do online. So what I'm doing right now is I'm current $7 now every Wednesday instead of $5 every Thursday. So we decrease the day at $2. So that uh, helps a little bit. Recurrent investment and roundups are still a thing. $7.56 roundup. I haven't really gotten gas anymore. I don't need to get gas anymore. Isn't that crazy? Um, we go back to home. We can, do, we can do the potential of this. So the potential of this, you know, I'm throwing it 7K. Obviously, you know, there's a 6% analyzed return, but I could always invest more at one big sum, all one lump sum at one big time. So, never know what can happen. Uh, but until then, I'm gonna keep on doing that. And now for the big boy, where we are down sixteen dollars on the day. Uh, so we're not doing too great. Um, we're down forty-five cents in the Roth IRA. I now have my active investing and my Roth IRA retirement investing. Uh, it's the traditional one, I believe. No, it's the Roth, not traditional. I'm so dumb, so silly. Uh, we can scroll down here. Let's see the recurring deposits, $2, because I only have so much money to give out. So, Texas Roadhouse, big dip. Um, it's just it's just a red day. Everything's fucking down. Everything's down. Uh, so if I select ETF, down. Apple's down. If, if if the ETFs are down, it means all these other shits are down. So Apple's down. Alibaba's down. Waste Manager's down. CP's down. DraftKings is down. JD's down. Vici's down. Uh, Vici. SoFi Tech, Schwab, ETF, GameStop, another ETF. Let's click into the active investing one. Take it look by look, stock by stock here. So I've made four dollars in dividends now, almost five. Market gains is eleven. Total gain is sixteen. Isn't that crazy? Um, this is my active thing, my unrealized gain. 953. So still pretty big gains in all these. Just letting it ride out. Um, we've had here's my recent activity through the past couple of things July 10th through now we got a little bit of dividends from Baba look at that big dollar 25 dividend from Baba my ADR fee one cent don't matter deposit DraftKings buy Baba buy I'm buying DraftKings while it's down I love buying DraftKings while it's down I think it could really make a big change make a big splash if you think so we're gonna click on let's go Texas Roadhouse so Past week, it was going up, and it, it just plummeted back down. So, because of this right here. <laughs> but still, Texas Roadhouse, I'm sure, will recover, recuperate, get a lot of cash the past three months. Um, I don't know why it's saying that. Plus 5%. It doesn't really update too long, this whole SoFi thing. But yeah, it's just a little. We had a dip right here, another dip right here. I mean, we had another dip right here, so it's all normal. Can't be too mad at it all. Uh, we're gonna hit the SoFi one up, as you know. The SoFi ETF is quite good if you don't have it. At least just it. 
all this beautiful stuff amazon apple tesla google salesforce you can be soaring why do you have apple and that in the etf well i like the etf because it has all these other things i don't have <laughs> and it's done to me pretty well in the past year <laughs> get a big dip right here I have another big dip right here so i knew that getting a stale at what where is it um, oh, right here. That's plus six dollars. So, not really minding too much. Not going too crazy over it. Apple. I mean, just kind of saw it, so I'm gonna skip that one. The SoFi Next is that what this one is? SoFi Next, 100 ETF. The, the company's not quite there in the top 500, but we're getting up there. Rivian enters. Robinhood's there. Win. Uh, some healthcare, some health products. I'm sure. But it's been steady going up. It's been a big increase. 13 all the way up to 14 uh 12 dip it down to 13.50 so another dollar 31 gain got some dividends from it hopefully somebody doesn't cancel this one too because if they cancel this one i'm gonna cancel so far i'm playing it's just gonna go with the DraftKings. we get there oh boy as it as it loads uh baba baba was supposed to be like a quick cash grab but i've kind of like stayed in it I really do think it could go back up. I kept it up here. Now it's back down here. I really think, I really think it can, it can, it can fucking rock it up again. Like, I think it can become right about maybe here, 115. I'll probably sell it to 100 at that point. Like, I just can't see anything really go anywhere from there. But Chinese market needs to go up. He's making recovery of waste management. Always, always a safe at waste management. Take a deep dive as most stocks have been doing recently. Uh, misses, you know, the uh, weekly through quarter earnings. Waste management uh, going up. A little bit of a dip. What's been going up? Just a couple of the other ones have. Past year, I probably should be checking them more intently. Um, Chain Pacific, I don't really care about. I'm not going to lie. I don't really know much about them. Um, here it is. Draft Kings past three months so we had a big dip big swing uh, uh now we're back on the down so i'm thinking hoping we get somewhere with this my unrealized gain is at negative eight dollars so uh, i would like to be around 43 preferably um if possible but you know it wasn't really right there one month ago it's going up went down up again and nothing too crazy jay's just another chinese one that i have uh vici's finally in the green the sofi stock is in the green and GameStop will forever be down because no one really cares about it so this has been going up and down as you've probably noticing as i uh, refresh the page every time i go in and out yeah this um month we're up a dollar <laughs> At six months, we're up 15. Here to date, we're up 15.59. And in the year, 14.93. Um, uh, the past week, they were down 25. So I was way higher. <laughs> I remember when this hit like 660, I think, somewhere around there. So it's just unfortunate, but that's how somewhere it goes. You lose some, you win some, you gain, you lose everything. Until then, see y'all next time. It is July 24th, 2024, Wednesday, 4.30 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. I will see y'all. I see ya. It was crazy, wasn't it?